The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. To solve this system of equations by substitution, since our first equation tells us that y equals 1 third x minus 1, we can substitute this 1 third x minus 1 in for the y in our second equation, which becomes 3x minus 2 times parentheses 1 third x minus 1 equals 4. Now we can solve for x by first distributing this negative 2 through the parentheses to get 3x minus 2 thirds x plus 2 equals 4. And now we need to get rid of the fraction by multiplying both sides of the equation by 3 to get 9x minus 2x plus 6 equals 12. Simplifying the left side, we have 7x plus 6 equals 12. Subtract 6 from both sides. And 7x equals 6. To solve for x, we divide both sides by 7. And notice that x equals the fraction 6 sevenths. To find y, we plug 6 sevenths back in for x in our first equation to get y equals 1 third times parentheses 6 sevenths minus 1. Notice that to solve for y, we're going to need to deal with some fractions. Simplifying the right side of this equation, we have 1 third times 6 sevenths, so we can cross cancel the 6 and the 3 to 2 and 1. We have 1 times 2, which is 2, and 1 times 7, which is 7. So y equals 2 sevenths minus 1, which can be thought of as y equals 2 sevenths minus 1 over 1. And we can simplify this by finding a common denominator of 7. So multiply top and bottom of the second fraction by 7 to get y equals 2 sevenths minus 7 sevenths, which simplifies to y equals negative 5 sevenths. So the solution to this system is 6 sevenths, negative 5 sevenths.